How's it going everybody? Zab here. We are now one week to the date into NHL 16 and uh, we've made some pretty good progress. We've played 20 games so far online, 15 wins, 4 losses, and 1 overtime or shootout loss. Uh, we are in Division 7. We have actually pulled some pretty nutty things, which I'm not used to. I usually pull nothing and uh, the team's looking... <laughs> Okay, it doesn't look too fantastic, but uh, it gets the job done. We're just going to jump straight into it, not hide anything. Uh, in one of my free packs, okay, for I think it was one of my uh, packs for, for uh, getting the Ultimate Edition of NHL 16, we actually pulled this beauty in a free pack, a Brent Burns who goes for like 30, 40 K. Uh, I recorded it, but for, for some reason I lost the clip, unfortunately. Uh, but I pulled Brent Burns, a disgusting, disgusting card, and I actually pulled a perfect lefty two-way D, uh, in a uh, in a collection pack that you're actually going to see within the next week or so, and uh, it's another solid solid pull. And before that, I opened up a pack and pulled another really really awesome special card. It might have been a junior flashback. It might have gone for a pretty penny. Uh, I might have made a lot of coins off of it. That may be why I have just about 70k in the bank. You're going to have to see that video, and you will very, very shortly. Other than that, forward-wise, Haglin, super speedy. That was kind of my game plan, just get some fast guys on the team. Uh, most guys you're playing in Division 10, 9, 8, 7, 6 uh, are going to have pretty basic teams, nothing too crazy, guys that aren't that fast. So if you have some speed, especially on the wing, you should be able to score some goals. So I got Haglin, but the captain card on him, 92 for the skating. Nielsen, pulled him in a free pack. Bot Camilleri, he's pretty good. Other than that, a lot of these guys are just free pack pulls and and uh, you know small pulls that I've I've gotten in other packs. Silverberg, Pekanic, Perron, Kunitz, Fisher, uh, Johansson, pair of toes. Bailey, MacArthur defensively, of course. Brent Burns, who's a beast. Girardi, Murray is really good as always. Uh, Kulikov, Gilbert, uh, Elliot, and then uh, the starter is actually. Uh, Austin Lotz, who's done not that bad, actually. His, his goals against average and save percentage, unfortunately, has gone down recently. He had a couple bad games there, but uh, other than the, the couple bad games, he's been performing excellent. And we can jump into the stats, I suppose, right now. Just going to look at some of the, the, the top point getters for the team here. Number one is going to be Brent Burns. So there's that 12 points in 13 games. Very, very good. Perron, 10 points in 13 games. Uh, Murray has 8 points in 13 games. He's down on the second line, but when he was on the, the first line with Burns, he was easily a point per game. Uh, they worked beautifully together, but the only reason I don't have him there now is because of the card that I pulled in the free packs. You'll see that again. Uh, Hagland, 6 points in 6 games. I actually just saw that. I, I didn't know how many points he had. That's impressive. I'll take that for a little 4K player. Uh, Camilleri, 5 points in 5 games. I'll take that for a little 4K player. Uh, so those guys are working well, I guess. 4 points in 5 games for Johansson. He's not doing a horrible job as a uh, as a third liner at all and other than that nothing you know too special there's only one person on the team who has zero points and that's Girardi a defensive defenseman so I guess somewhat to be expected goaltender wise Elliot is uh three and two with a 2.0 goals against average lots is eight and three with a 2.0 goals against average lots with the 88 save percentage Elliot with the 83 lots for a long stretch of time actually had a 94 save percentage and he was just killing it like I said he really had three games that were bad and those obviously he lost and unfortunately that kind of took the goals against average and uh, and save percentage and and kind of screwed it up a little bit but still doesn't look that bad at all especially for 73 overall I've not been using him boosted so he's he's gotten the job done just about every game we have 69k in the bank and uh, I can't complain. Hut's really fun this year. NHL 16's really fun this year. Uh, I'm having a, a great time. I've pulled some pretty good things in packs. Beamer, oh my goodness gracious, great balls of fire. Beamer completed a collection, right? You guys know who Beamer is. He's on Twitter. Follow him. Uh, crazy guy. He, he pulled in a collection pack for Carolina. Pulled this. And Evgeny Malkin, like, are you kidding me? So nutty. Uh, I can't even believe that. 400 and something K there. He's pulled some other nutty stuff. He pulled, like, a Yager. There's 25K. Uh, he pulled a McKinnon. There's, like, what, 60K. He pulled some... Oh, my gosh. The guy just... It's ridiculous. I don't know how he does it. Uh, hopefully, we can have some of that pack luck in the near future. Uh, so, if you did enjoy this video, go ahead and hit it with a big thumbs up. Subscribe for much, much more. Uh, in the comment section down below, let me know what your guys' hut teams are looking like. Who's on your first line? Uh, who's on your fourth line? What goal? are you using i'm looking to maybe buy some new goalies elliot's not really all that great so i might buy a new backup uh, and, and all that good stuff so as always guys i'm zab and i'll see you next time